In this video, we'll learn what Gauss's law is and how it works. We'll also look at some basic terms related to it. First thing we learn about is area vector. Although area is a scalar, but the area vector shows the direction of a surface. It always points perpendicular to the surface. Next is electric flux. Electric flux means how many electric field lines pass through a surface. It is shown by the symbol phi. The formula is phi equals E times S times cos theta. Flux depends on three things. One, electric field strength E. Two, surface area S. Three, angle theta between the field and area vector. If the angle is zero degrees, flux is maximum. If the angle is 90 degrees, flux is zero. To find the total flux, we break the surface into small parts and use integration. Now, let's understand Gauss's law. The total electric flux through a closed surface is equal to the total charge inside divided by epsilon zero. Phi equals Q divided by epsilon zero. This law makes it easy to calculate the electric field for shapes like spheres, cylinders, or planes. 